on Bulldog Bites. We're here to take a look at last week's game and to prepare for this week's opponent. And with me is Tim, the Bulldog fan. Tim, last Friday night we kind of ran into a buzzsaw uh, down in Savannah. Uh, what was your takeaway from that game? All right, well, for starters, it was a scrimmage. So, you know, you kind of you have to understand that you're going to be learning here. We got a lot of new players, um, a lot of new p- people on the field, so they got got to learn some. Um, Benedict team's Benedict team. You know, you go down there, um, they got all the players they have. Um, they run a fast-paced offense that run us into the dirt more or less. I mean, I thought we were still going hard, but when you've got that many players – um, going both ways, it, it does wear you down. Um, other than that, um, our kicking game, first first week, um, new players, that's got to get a little better, I think. I thought our kicking game needed some work. Um, other than that, I thought we run the ball decent at times. Our uh, offensive line wasn't too bad. Um, the way we talked about earlier, um, you know, if they loaded up the box, of course, uh, not a whole lot you can do. But uh, I thought we did pretty good, especially for all new players. Um, defensively, gave up some points. Um, gave up one on a punt. Uh, you know, uh, got to uh, get a little better with that. But then again, they were running that fast pace spread sometimes. Just They had probably four or five different sets they ran out of. So it was really hard to deal with that. Um, I think we'll get better. Um, I'm not unhappy about what we saw Friday night. Um, knowing that we got to get better and we will i agree there's a lot of room for improvement but that's what you expect with a young team and i feel certain that our coaching staff will have us ready to go this friday night we face twigs county a team that traditionally uh, is more suited to the kind of uh, defense and the mentality that Toombs County has always had. We've always been really strong against the run, and Tweez County is going to bring in here, and they're going to be uh, a majority run team. That's not to say that they would never pass, but uh, they're going to majority uh, run. So how do you feel about that? Um, You know, it's been a couple of years since we played Twigs. Um, Played them at home here. They had a couple of good-looking running backs back in those days. Um, Of course, we did too, and we still do. Um, I think we'll match up a lot better with them. Um, They're not going to, you know, be able to run that fast pace quite as much. Um, They're going to have similar numbers to us. Um, And you're right. I think a team that runs more than they pass, we do a little better with. Um, you know, we, our defense is more attuned to that. Now, we've got some good defensive backs. I think we can handle passing teams. Um, but when you're doing both proficient like they did last week, it's kind of tough. So you won't face too much of that. Um, they'll be either one or the other usually. Um, I think we'll do good. We just got to get out there and um, show them some Toombs County football. That's what's important. That's right. We've got to develop that mentality and uh, with a new team. With uh, new personnel, uh, people that are practicing hard. I've been to see several practices, and they are practicing extremely hard, and they're working extremely hard. So I think Twiggs County is going to see a different team than probably what they've already seen on film against uh, Benedictine in Savannah last week. Uh, and I agree with your assessment of our secondary. Uh, that's the strength of our uh, pass defense, uh, three starters coming back. And even though Benedictine completed some passes the other night, uh, our secondary was in in the right position at the right time. Uh, it was just that their quarterback was that accurate. I mean, he put the ball on the numbers sometimes into double coverage and was able to complete a pass. And I don't expect us to see that week in and week out uh, in our region. 